hide it, you can't come inside it Cause I'm moving different Yeah, you don't know what you missing But you know that I'm different He feeling on me, I got his attention He tripping on me, he said I've been missing Don't feel like texting, I'm out on a mission Been in the game, the level is different And all of my niggas, they know how to flip it Can I sleep on me, they paying attention Room full of bitches, I'm feeling attention Shorty got ass, I told her to Welcome to High Style Sundays, y'all know what's going on We got Eternity Davis in the building Period What's going on with you? You ain't know the vibes. What's up, y'all? Thank y'all for having me. You ain't know the vibes. Um, so, for everybody that doesn't really know who you are and mm -hmm. you know, what you're about, let us know. You know, let us know what you do, what you, you know, what you get into. Um, All right. So, I'm a rapper. I sing a little bit. Um, I'm rapping for a little minute now. Uh, probably like, damn. I've been rapping for like a couple of years. I can't even tell you since high school, for real. Um, but I really started off singing because my mother was a singer, you feel me? Um, and she could sing real good. So it's like, yeah, I try to do like, be like her and stuff. My dad could sing a little bit too. Okay. That's that. Um, okay. And yeah, so. Where are, you, um, where are you originally from? I'm from New York. New York. Queens in the building. You already know Queens get the money. Gangsta. Were you Hello. in New York your whole like, you know, childhood? Um, yeah, I was in New York for a little bit and then I went to North Carolina and then Florida. I was everywhere for real. Like, I'm always on the go. Like I ain't gonna hold you. So what was it like I wanna take it back? What mm -hmm. was it like, you know, growing up as a child for you? Um, it was good for real. Like I did a couple of things, like I was always going out with my friends and stuff like that. Um I always had a little boyfriend or something, you feel me? So that was that. I felt like I was that girl, gangsta, period. I am that girl, gangsta. Just took them all. Anyway, but yeah, so life growing up was lit. Um, people was fucking with me, still fucking with me. And I just thought on that. Okay. Do you feel like anything in your childhood plays a part in your music now? Um... Hmm. I mean, all my songs is really based off things that happen in my life for real. So like, when you really listen to them, it's like, it's all like everything that happened to me before or it's something that happened to somebody close to me or something like, it's everything I experienced, you feel me? So that's really how I write for real. So like your song, Moving Different. Mm-hmm. That you can, you know, that's yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. So explain that. Yeah, no, we're moving a little um, bit. So, all right. So, moving different. I wrote that one after I got out of like a relationship. I was in it for like four years. You feel me? That was my longest relationship or whatever. So, I was in my bag. And I'm like, you know what? I'm not really fucking with this no more. So, I'm about to just start moving different. Gangsta. So I dubbed everything for me, everybody, and I just started doing my own thing for me. I'm all about the bread now. That said, like trying to get right, like I want to travel, I want to do a whole bunch of stuff for me. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And I want to get into your name, mm -hmm. Eternity Davis. Yeah. Why that name? Well, Eternity is my real name, so. That's that, and I just was like, you know, that's fire. I ain't never hear nobody with you turn to you, feel me? I'ma just go with that, you feel me? Um, it lasts forever, so hopefully, you know what I'm saying? My music gonna last forever, obviously. You know, I want to make a mark, for real, you feel me? Like, that's just that. Like, my name, turn to me. And do you feel like that has an impact on the way you, you, ha you feel like you have to create your music? Mm -hmm. That has such a deep meaning? Yeah, it definitely does, though. It definitely does. Um, like, I feel like, okay, I just, okay, I'm a Pisces for one. So, you know, I already think deeply into everything, you feel me? So, it's like I want to put that into a song and stuff. I already listen to music. It's all fire. I know how it's supposed to sound. And I'm already listening to it. I'm like, damn, like, this shit hard for real, you feel me? And it's something people could listen to for a long time. You know what I'm saying? It's not just no, like, I'm um, just throwing it out. And it's that, like, I'm really putting my all into it. Like, it's really how I feel for real, you feel me? So, 
It's deep, like my name. Okay, okay. And saying that, yeah. it sounds like you have a lot of passion for your music, and love for your music. Yeah. So what's like, is there like a certain thing or person that inspired you, really? Um, okay. What really inspired you? Well, my mother for one, definitely, because she was always singing. So I would never like, you feel me, like, love that lady for that. Um, and then she blessed me with that, you feel me? So it's like, I appreciate her. Um, my first love, because he was rapping. He looked like Fab, sound like Fab. It's crazy, you feel me? So I kind of got into it because of him for real. But like, you know, um, I like Nicki. Um, as far as right now, I like Cardi because her delivery and stuff like that. Um, Coyle Ray because her confidence, you feel me? Um, Nicki, of course, because her, you know, bars. That wordplay is crazy, you feel me? But, you know, that's really... Drake, too, because he be switching it up. Yeah. And I feel like I be doing a little bit of that, you feel me? And, and yeah. Okay, okay. And uh -huh. I know we're in Baltimore here. Okay. But, you know... Knowing that you're from New York, uh -huh. how does that New York sound, that New York, uh, you know, the music culture out there, how does that impact you? Um, well, it's, New York music is very different from, well, I ain't gonna say that. My music is different from how they do it, like the drill music and stuff like that. Like, my shit is more vibey and everything. Like, I ain't talking about, like, dropping bodies and all this crazy shit. Like, I'm just on some cool, like... You know, you ain't your feelings, some Janae Aiko shit, you feel me, like, or a lot, like, um, so I don't feel like, I mean, but I could get on some stuff like that, because I really switch it up for real, but it's like, I feel like my music is really different from how New York sound is for real right now, you feel me, what's blowing up for them right now, you feel me, so, And do yeah. you feel like, because creating your music, you don't, mm -hmm. you don't want to sound the same but you also want to sound you know, sound like yourself like yeah you're mm -hmm. so do you feel like it's a challenge for you creating music and trying to you know compete with others mm. well i don't really consider it a competition for real because i feel like we all different in our own way you feel me like and it all sound good regardless so because we could all hop on the same beat and create something fire you feel me so i wouldn't say it's competing or nothing like it just all sound good but um i don't know like i just think i ain't gonna hold you on i kind of forgot the question i ain't even gonna hold you body, just body, 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 body. <laughs> you feel like how do you feel like, how do you hold your music? Like, what kind of standard do you hold your music to? Like, I just feel like, I don't know, I feel like everybody could really bump my shit for real. Like, on some real shit from, cause it's really about some stuff anybody could relate to, like a heartbreak, you feel me? Like, um, I don't know, like, I don't know. I just, on a deeper level, it, it gets you more in tune with your like, soft side you feel me like on that type of time but still like keeping the gangster a little bit like i'm not all the way like come on like period <laughs> not about to play with me so yeah okay, okay hello and your music you know most of the time okay. you know, some people rap about anything uh-huh about their life yeah you know you keep reiterating uh -huh. it's about you know how you live and that so yeah how do you factor in like your real like every day maybe your struggles or even your strong points throughout and then still create have time to create your music um i mean honestly it's never a time i'm not creating like right now i'm thinking about a song you feel me like i ain't even gonna hold you i got i make songs without beats for real so it's like i could just be saying thinking about it like so I don't really, it's not really like I have to put time aside to do that, you feel me? Like, at any point in time, I'm really sitting here creating a song, you feel me? And it's going to be fire every time. Gangsta. Like, nah, I don't even know. Do you feel like, do you feel like, because as an artist, you know, your mental health is very important. Mm -hmm. So do you feel like you've ever had any, like, maybe low points and how did you overcome them? Um, yeah, kind of, yeah, like, I was depressed at one point, 
in my life after the whole little breakup I was talking about, you feel me? So it kind of was hard for me to write a little bit. I kind of just was in my bag or whatever, but then I just kept listening to music and I'm like, you know, while I'm sitting here in my bag, you feel me? Like, and I could be lit right now. Like, let's really do this shit, you feel me? Like, so I just started writing more and more and I just put all my like energy into that. Like, however I'm feeling, I'm just gonna write then, like, and let it be that, you feel me? Like, hmm. And it seems like, so I'm guessing you don't freestyle none that, you just straight right there. Mm, but I'm trying to learn how to freestyle though. I've been getting better against the. Period. You, I'm gonna get there. You sing too, as well. Mm hmm. Yeah. So, what's the, like, when you're in the studio, how do you, like, what's your vibe when you get in the studio? Like, what's your, you know? Um, well, as soon as I get in there, gotta smoke. Ray, no. I'm lit. Period. Um, I fuck with my engineer, Dan, real one, gangster, for me. Um, and I kind of just like, I, I'm when I'm going to the studio, I already know what I'm there to do. So it's like, I'm ready, you feel me? Like it's in and out, let me do this, you feel me? Like, don't waste no time. We here for a certain amount of time, you feel me? Got to do this, you know what I'm saying? Like, so smoke real quick, put that beat on and record, you feel me? Yeah. yeah okay. You have a favorite studio? Um, It's in New York. Okay. So that's where Dan's at. I think Long Island. I think, sound like that, maybe. So, what else can we find you doing besides making music? Oh, I know how to draw, period. You see that on my highlights on Instagram, E-T-E-R-N-I-T-Y-D-A-V-I-S. Make sure you add me, period, for me. Um, I could dance, but like, I ain't gonna hold you on some like, you know, merengue and shit like that. Like, I took a class. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nobody said. <laughs> so, yeah, that was that. But um, I can do that. So, you know, when I want to get there, we could do that. But, um, <laughs> you know, that's really it for real. Like, you know, I tried to do nails for a little bit, but... I'm impatient. I can do hair a little bit. I ain't do my hair really too crazy, but it's okay, you know. Look at mine, it's going bad bitch all the time, period. Fuck you talking about? We in there. But you know, I can do a lot of stuff, but. Do you have like. That's music. Or would you say like, would you say like music's your only passion? Yeah, for real. Yeah. Cause I know what I could do with that for real, you feel me? But I don't want to just do that. Like, eventually, I want to have, like, my own businesses and stuff, too. You feel me? Like, because I don't want to just do music forever. Eventually, that's going to get, like, old. You feel me? So. Do you, like, have any plans to, like, maybe eventually, like, when you, you know, get to that level or that point to help your community out? Uh, yes, of course. Definitely. You know, like, what? Ways, like, um, you I mean, I ain't going to hold you. I ain't really feeling the whole piece no more, like the projects. I just want to fix all that up. Like, I just feel like it's not it, you feel me? Like, I see how my people was living, and I'm not really fucking with it, you feel me? Like, and how I was living, so I just want to, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, change a whole bunch of shit as far as buildings and stuff like that. Like, mm -hmm. everything, how everybody living, like, I feel like it'd be way better there's just too much going on right now, so, yeah. Okay, okay. And I know I asked you, um, you know, what standard you hold your music to, mm -hmm. but from, a, from your, you know, people that listen to music viewpoint, mm -hmm. how do you want them to perceive you? How do you want them to see you? I mean, shit. It really don't matter for real. Like, I don't really want them to see me any kind of way. I want them to see me however they see me, you feel me? It's just that if you fuck with me, you fuck with me. If you don't, you don't, you feel me? Like, it's just that on that. I can't please everybody and I'm not here to please everybody, you feel me? So it's like, I could accept that for real, like, so, yeah. Okay. And where do you hope to take this career? Like, where do you see yourself at? Um, shit. I don't even know, I'm just trying to be at the top, man, like, as far as I could go, you feel me? I don't have no limitations on it, like, keep going further, you feel me? With every day, period. That's, 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 that's tough, that's tough. So, as a female, 
in, mm -hmm. in the game, really. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like there's any anything you wish you could change to do, like maybe work with people, make it easier? Do you feel like you know there's a difference between the male and female as you know aspect in the rap game? Like, how do you feel about it? Um. Does okay. It even, you know, does it even bother you? So. I mean, nothing don't really bother me for real, you feel me? Like, it ain't really putting no bread in my pockets to worry about what, what's going on over there. But, you feel me, if I could say, you know what I'm saying, how I feel about it, um, I like fucking with the males for real because it's like, okay, back to the competition thing. Maybe it is a little competition for males, you feel me? Like, I like females. I do want to work with a lot of females, but I really want to work with a lot of males too, you feel me? Because I feel like, I don't know, like, they just gangster, you feel me? Like, and I feel like I've been around my brothers and stuff like that. So it's like, I know how to write and I be sounding like that too. So it's like, I just feel like one of the gods, you feel me? Yeah. Period. Okay. None of the vibes. So yeah. And if you can give advice to you know, any young artist anywhere, what would you <clears> tell <throat> Bro, just keep doing it, like for real. Like you don't understand. I know everybody say this is gonna be hard and stuff, but like you gotta keep going. Like you never know what could happen. Like shit, tomorrow I could be late. You feel me? Just cause somebody could see me on here. Never know. Like just keep going. You feel me? Don't let nothing bother you. Cause at the end of the day, it's not gonna matter no more. You feel me? Once you get lit, think about that bag. Think about what could happen for you. You feel me? Like all that is nothing. Like fuck the stress. Fuck all that other extra shit. Like. Do your thing, like for real. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. And I know you got your music on Spotify, Apple Music. Mm -hmm. almost, I think it's out everywhere, right? Yes, so period. Let them, let them know where they can follow you at. And then um, shout out any last words you want to say. You know the vibes. Follow me on Instagram, E T E R N I T Y D A V I S, period. Facebook, Eternity Davis, E T E R N I T Y D A V I S, period. Snapchat, Eternity dot Davis, <laughs> E T E R N I T Y dot D A V I S, period. Not the vibes. That's where you found all my music, how to stay. Oh, wait, my TikTok too, but I forgot the username. I ain't going to hold you. I think it's Eternity Music 98. Add me on there. We lit. All right, all right. Period. Appreciate you once again. Tony <laughs> Davis came down. We got Laboka Tequila. Yeah. Down here in the Dream Factory. Loud yeah. studio. Y'all know what's going on. Yes. Appreciate you again. Period. Thank you for having me. Of course,